Good afternoon. My name is Ida Carruthers, and I am privileged to serve as General Secretary of the Samuel DeWitt Conference. Our conference was started uh, with the vision to particularly uh, agitate and organize the black church to be more engaged in social justice issues around the world. And of course, as we gather here at the National Black um, Agenda uh, Summit, we are here looking at what are the state uh, conditions impacting the community of African people, particularly in the United States, but that might inform uh, multiple next steps. One would, of course, be the outcome for the presidential election in the United States, but even beyond that, how people of African descent globally might organize and connect the dots in terms of the conditions that we find ourselves in and to take greater responsibility and build greater capacity to address those issues. So I, along with uh, my brother here, old Benji, who I've been privileged to work with for years, have been asked to just kind of co-facilitate a conversation particularly around mass incarceration. Um, the second is with property conferences we're working over the last um, year and a half um, dealing with this whole issue of mass incarceration and getting as much information as we can out to the community in ways that would provide a basis for education for our community that would stimulate advocacy activities in our communities and that would absolutely um, create um, the advocacy and the activism that would lead to legislative and public policy change. So having said that, then, we've been privileged to work with Michelle Alexander. We created a study guide that took her work in the community-based faith based study guide so that it would be more accessible to people. And we've just come off of two days of hearings in the state of Illinois on uh, mass incarceration in the state of Illinois, collecting stories from the community and the ground, attempting, therefore, then to synthesize this into a report that will feed into a national movement. We're positioned now to do these two-day hearings in 22 states around the country. But for this particular event here, as we are gathered, uh, a group of us are in this circle because we are committed to addressing this um, issue from both a historical point of view and a contemporary point of view. So what I would like to do a little bit in terms of how we can set the uh, framework for this is just to um, share that you know we have the, the great use of technology and to share with those who are engaged through the technology is to just share some common ground understanding that will set uh, the platform for the conversation because everybody here in one way or another is expert and a facilitator of this conversation and represents a constituency that can make a difference. In preparing for the National Black Agenda, um, you will note that in the working papers, um, I drafted a piece that talked about mass incarceration as a site of relocation. And I want to step back a bit to talk about the context for mass incarceration and the prison system and the prison venue as a site of relocation. 